It's time for Let's Do Better This Week. First, Rudy Giuliani. Uh, screw it. I don't have time for this guy. And that's the truth. The real truth, not the truth that's not the truth or whatever the hell you were trying to say on Meet the Press. I'd rather talk about the Space Force. Whoever came up with the name Space Force, let's do better this week. I see the value in protecting our communication and even military satellites, but Space Force is embarrassing. How does Air Force sound so cool, but Space Force sounds terrible? Like something you only say when you're a nine-year-old with a lisp. Space Force. My mommy got me a new Space Force toy. Or as our nine-year-old president put it, Space Force all the way. Apparently, Trump's obsessed with the idea. Axios reports that he would ask random questions about rocket ships and marvel to hear about satellites and the junk floating in space. His questions were unfocused, like a student trying to learn about a new subject. It was just one of those subjects that piqued his interest, the source said. Okay, uh, I can't take it. This president takes so much pride in his utter lack of intellectual curiosity, unless it's rocket ships. And you, have you seen the logos people get to choose from for the Space Force? They're hilarious. I've double and triple checked that they were the actual logos that the administration is having the public vote on because they seem too ridiculous to be true. For those listening to the podcast, uh, they look like Disney or Disneyland Space Mountain concept art. Uh, or as one person says, Mars awaits. No, Mars awaits uh, a better logo. I swear, this president wears Buzz Lightyear pajamas. And also, the Air Force already has a Space Force. It's called the Air Force Space Command, which has its own ridiculous logo that looks like it should be embroidered on costumes in a B movie from 1955. Someone who doesn't need to do better this week is whoever took Mike Pence's Space Force speech and added the theme music from the game Halo. When it comes to defending our nation and protecting our way of life, the only thing we can't afford is inaction. The American people deserve our very best, and they will have it. That's it, Mike Pence would make a great Space Force commander in a video game. You know why? Because if it got too bad, I could turn it off. So Space Force, let's do better this week. Oh, you know you wanna see more videos like this. Just subscribe to the channel below. And don't forget to become a TYT member and download the TYT Plus app on your phone. Head over to tyt.com slash join today.